guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm having a great day. In today's video is the annual What I Got For Christmas 2021. Now, this I want to say is the eighth uh, Christmas haul that I have filmed. Can't believe it's been eight years. It has absolutely flown by. Um, just before I start, obviously the annual disclaimer for really everybody that does it is obviously I'm not bragging or trying to show off in any way, shape or form. I am absolutely grateful for everything I have received and I know I'm very lucky. Um, right down to the cards, like just Christmas is such a thoughtful time, um, spending it with loved ones and stuff and that's what's most important. It's always about who's around your tree rather than what's under it. Let's start with what I got for Christmas. So to start off, um, as always, Christmas Eve box. Um, and in my Christmas Eve box was the PJs that I actually have on, but I will insert the family photo here so that you can kind of get the whole um, look of the PJs. So that was in my Christmas Eve box along with some fluffy socks that just are uh, Mickey and Minnie. In fact, is that just Minnie? I'm not too sure. <laughs> but yeah, fluffy socks. Then I got some reindeer socks and then I got some more fluffy socks but it's so cute because it's like little pandas on it. And then I got a, I have sheet like eye mask because I love like kind of face masks and stuff. Um, then I got a Terry's chocolate orange because that's one of my favourite chocolates and you just can't go wrong with chocolate orange. Then I got Doritos, they are my favourite Doritos. Along with some Galaxy Minstrels. Uh, Cadbury's Caramel, some Kinder Chocolate and Fruit Pastels. I love Fruit Pastels but I don't buy them because the only flavours I like are the strawberry and blackcurrant, the red and black Fruit Pastels that I like. Um, so when they started doing a bag alone of just that stuff, um, eh, of just the time, sorry, I've, I'm obsessed. So <laughs> a bag of them. And two cans of passion fruit martini because that is one of my favourite drinks. Please don't try if you're under the age of 18 or 21 if you stay in the States. But yeah, that was everything in my Christmas Eve box. Next, we're going to start with the gifts that I got on Christmas. Um, so one was the Guinness World Record Book 2022. This is, it's like a family tradition at this point. I think this will be the last year that I do receive it. But I have got one of these books every single year for Christmas without fail. Um, I just used to love them when I was younger. And my mum and dad kind of just thought, we'll get her it as kind of the, the joke gift kind of thing. Because it's just like a tradition. Next, I got some earrings in this lovely bag. And it literally is just little dream catchers. Because I have a dream catcher necklace, which is one of my favourite necklaces to wear. Um, so I kindly received the Dreamcatcher earring to match. I'll insert a close-up photo here. So that's the Dreamcatcher earrings. Next I got some clothes. So to start off I got some nice grey Converse joggies that are just cuffed at the bottom. So I got them. Then I got this top and it just says, oh, get the tag out of those, just says love on it and a heart. But they're like L's part of the heart. Next top that I got was this one and it says meant to be. A saying that I always say, it's just, if, if it's meant to be, it'll be. So I love that. Then I just got some more joggies, which were Under Armour. And these are black. Again, cuffed at the bottom. So yeah, these are the Under Armour joggies that I got. Then the next I got, which is actually like a tracksuit. It's just this lovely minty colour I don't even know how it's not even mint really it's kind of like a baby blue royal blue it's not royal blue I'm going to say like an a mint turquoise I don't know how well the camera will pick it up but yeah it's basically it's adidas this one is cropped but it is so lovely so that's the top and then the bottoms are literally just joggies again kind of cuffed at the bottom and yeah they are lovely so that was the clothes that i got but just sticking with that theme i did receive some jammies if i can stop um which are these they are so fluffy and i just know they're going to be so warm i love and they say bugs on the trousers and the top obviously has 
Bugs Bunny on it. But yeah, so I got these jammies, which are so fluffy. I love them. So the next thing I got was this pen and it's got my initial on it, which is obviously A. And yeah, I love stationery, so that's great. The next thing I got was a mug and it says June babes brighten your day because that was the month I was born and I just love it, it's such a cool mug. And then sticking with that uh, June theme is so I got a candle and again it says June babes brighten your day which is scented white jasmine but this is like a case which I thought was quite cool. Oh no I dropped it, that's not cool. And it just has lovely kind of writing on it. Again just says June babes brighten your day and it's just lovely. It smells so good as well <laughs> so thank you and then the next gift i got was some led lights for my car like you know where the pedals are and stuff uh, they just kind of project color onto the floor of that area um or really whatever you decide to go to but that's the demonstration on the the back which is just shows you obviously where the pedals are and stuff and the colors so that was that and then the next thing I got was some tarot cards, which, oh my god, cool packaging by the way. <laughs> I think it's because of the, the light. But yeah, I really want to be able to do like tarot cards and read palms and all that, so that was quite cool. So next I got some more bath stuff. So I got a bath fizzer in the shape of Minnie Mouse. I then got a bath fizzer, which is Elsa's kind of frozen snowflake, but it's shimmery. And then I got some masks so i got a minnie mouse face mask i got a frozen face mask but in the christmas eve box it was the eye mask and then speaking of eye masks i got a minnie mouse eye mask as well which is quite cool which is actually cool because it's like it's a resealable bag because that's just like one treatment then that's like two treatments so that's quite cool so yeah that was the bath stuff and then the next thing I got was a lovely bottle of perfume, which is Beyoncé Heat. This is one of my favourites. Um, I just love it. It smells so good. And then the next thing I got was a pair of slippers, which are so fluffy. So fluffy. So they're just a lovely kind of caramel colour, I want to say. Um, so yeah, lovely slippers that I got. The next gift I got was Mamma Mia front row seat tickets to go and see... Mamma Mia at the musical uh, with my mum. I can't wait. It's a musical we've spoken about going to see for literal years. So hopefully we get to see it next May, providing we're not in a lockdown. So the next thing I got was a bottle of AU Vodka in the flavour Blue Raspberry. Haven't tried it, so look forward to trying that. And then staying in the, again, over 18. Please try if you're over 18 or over 21 if you're in the States. Um, same with this, another alcoholic drink which was Sewers Raspberry. Again, this is my favourite Sewers, I believe. I say I believe because the cherry's really good as well. But yeah, so I got them to have, which is lovely. Please do drink responsible though. <laughs> the next thing I got, again, I get one every year, a Lynx set. Um, it's just part of the paintwork at this rate. <laughs> the next gift I got was a lovely gift set, um, which is for like, so it's got a bath fizzer in it. It's got sorry, it's got two pa bath fizzers in it, and then some bath soap. That's the contents of it, and it's just like a space theme, which is quite cool. So I got that. Which can we talk about the packaging? Absolutely love the packaging. So the next stuff I got was some Bath and Body Works stuff, which living in the UK we can't get really. Um, but luckily Next has started doing Bath and Body Works stuff. It's very limited. And the stuff goes really quickly because again, it is a American brand, so we don't really get it. So when I seen this on Christmas Day, I was like, oh my God, can't believe it. So I got two Dark Kiss moisturizers because this is my favorite scent. I also received the Body Mist in the scent, Dark Kiss as well. And then we got the Foaming Hand Soap in the Black Cherry Merlot, which is quite nice because when we were in Florida, we got the sanitizer of it so this smells so good as well so diving into the next stuff i got and this lovely bag here so we have this which is a travel map scratch poster so basically if i went to australia i would scratch australia off on this map to say that i've been kind of thing so this was really lovely because obviously i love traveling so that was a great gift um 
the next thing I got was this, which I absolutely can't wait to use because obviously it's a bath bomb and I love bath bombs and that's great. Or anything bath related really. But this has um, a piece of jewellery inside of it, which I just thought it's a cool concept. And I've never had anything like it before, so I'm intrigued to use it and see what jewellery I got. So it's just a strawberry slushy bath bomb and it says a jewellery surprise inside and it'll be sterling silver so I cannot wait to use this bath bomb and before the before this video goes up I will have used it so I'll insert here um, either a photo or a, a quick video of the piece of jewellery inside bath bomb. The next thing I got was this lovely Nivea set and it says you're a cracker and inside it just has a face mask, some moisturiser and a lip balm in it, which can we just appreciate the packaging. And then the next thing I got was in this lovely little case and it is, um, I'll insert a kind of close up photo here, but it basically is Gemini earrings because that's my star sign and I love anything Gemini. Um, so yeah, lovely Gemini earrings. That's not a Gemini earring, just in case you're like, that's two different earrings. Um, when I opened it with my friend, I took the earring out that I was wearing, which was this one to put a Gemini one in. Um, so yeah, I'll insert a close-up of that at the moment. Then the next thing I got, oh, hands up there, was another candle um, staying on the Gemini theme. It does say Gemini, and the scent is apparently what is associated with Gemini or something, so I heard, <laughs> but it smells so good. It's really like it's vanilla, -y, very vanilla, I would say. But yeah, love. So the next thing I got was a mug, and on the mug it says, "I might look like I'm listening to you, but in my head I'm booking a holiday." Um, <laughs> it just says it on both sides, and I'll insert a close-up photo here. But yeah, love that. And then, speaking of like holidays and travel, bit of a theme going on here. It is a lovely keyring. Again, I will insert a photo here to show you the close-up of it. But it just has a little passport charm, a little world charm, a camera, uh, my initial A and then June's birthstone, which is lovely. And then, sticking to the theme of keyrings, I received this lovely thoughtful keyring as well. And it has a picture of my hashtag in it and then it's got an angel, an angel wing on it and a little heart and then this little kind of saying and it says those we love don't go away they walk beside us every day again i'll insert a close-up photo of it here but yeah this just means a lot and i really really do love it and yeah so the next thing i got was some hot teasers teasers because you just cannot go wrong with chocolate i love chocolate so much and especially not teasers they're so good so the next gift this i received was this lovely a4 portrait of ant and deck with a color splash background which i now need to get a lovely frame for because this can definitely go on my wall <laughs> but yeah i absolutely love this and the next gift i got was a bottle of another one of my favourite perfumes which is Michael Kors Sexy Amber which I had just run out of before Christmas so it's absolutely lovely to be stocked up again and then the next gift I got was another bottle of perfume and it's just a sparkle edition and yeah it's got an actual a really nice bottle to it it smells amazing as well but oh, I don't put the lid back on there we go but yeah how pretty is that bottle but yeah, it smells lovely, so thank you. The next gift I got is Marks and Spencer's Percy Pig Musical Rotating Tin because I am literally a child. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> How much do you just love that? Um, and it comes with Percy Pigs inside, so was this box of Passion Fruit Martini, again, please drink responsible, um, over 18 or 21, depending on where you live. But yeah, I promise I'm not actually an alcoholic. <laughs> um, 
but yeah so i got a box of passion fruit martini the next thing i got was this lovely set and it's an eye mask and fluffy socks which are so soft the next thing i got was this lovely hand painted wine glass well gin glass even and it got some confetti in it and like chocolates and stuff but it is absolutely lovely so i got that and then the next thing i got was again can't go wrong with chocolate so just a tub of roses and then also that's gonna fall <laughs> and then i got a lovely lush set which is then the scent little snow fairy and inside it's got the snow fairy bath bomb and the snow fairy shower gel because it's just it is divine absolutely divine um, and then the next thing I got was this lovely photo frame in rose gold with a picture of me and my friend Amy in it. Um, yeah, which is just lovely. So that was that. So the next thing I got was this lovely Soap and Glory set and it comes in a nice case. Plus the detail of it is really nice. It's even got the wee and sign as the, the zip. So yeah, got this Soap and Glory set. And then the next thing is this Sharpie set because, again, I just love stationery. The next thing I got was this Impulse set, which comes in a lovely case. And it just has um, three full-size body sprays in it. And the scent, very pink. Oh, this is shocking, I can't read this. Instant Crush and Tease. And then obviously the lovely case, that's lovely. And then the next thing I got again, can't go wrong with chocolates, tub of heroes and uh, Santa's reindeer. So the next thing I got was from <laughs> Chanel and it is a lovely Chanel snow globe. It is stunning. You can't see it from here, but I will insert the video that I took on Christmas day of it. It is just stunning. My new love and obsession seems to be snow globes at the moment. <laughs> But they are just so pretty. So I will insert the video of this Chanel one up close so you can see the detailing of it. But it is lovely. Really like, so stunning. I am obsessed with it. The next thing I got was this lovely Bugs Bunny mug. And it's got a hot chocolate mix inside of it. So yeah, love that. I love like unusual mugs like Bugs Bunny obviously on this one. And then um, I actually got... Like obviously Aunt Deck on one and my wee cousins on one and yeah I love like unique to unusual mugs. Speaking of mugs I did also get this one with my two wee cousins on it Lucas and Lewis and then it says April we love you and that's just like that is one of my favourite mugs ever and then I also got another snow globe <laughs> again I'll insert a small video of like it up close so you can see the detail in it and basically just has like santa looking into like the moon kind of thing i want to say and it's got a picture of me lucas and lewis in it and yeah i just absolutely love it like they kind of gifts are priceless so the next gift i got was bath bombs because we know how much i love bath stuff um self-care and all that jazz but yeah so i got Nine bath bombs that are all lovely colours and lovely scents as the back if you really want to know the scents. There you go. So yeah, that's that gift. And then the next gift I got, <laughs> staying in the theme of bath bombs, I got this lovely Lush set which has ten bath bombs in it and it does say Christmas bath time favourites on it. And it is lovely. Can we just appreciate Lush packaging though? Like that is stunning. And then inside this one it has the Snow Fairy bath bomb, the Sleepy Bear bath bomb, You Shall Go to the Ball bath bomb, Shoot for the Stars bath bomb which is one of my favourites, the Jingle Bells ball bath bomb. <laughs> well it just says Jingle Bells bath bomb but I bet you can't have Jingle Bell ball um, this year which was amazing. I, it has I Want a Hippopotamus for Christmas bath bomb, butter bear, bath bomb, hey hollywood, bath bomb, <laughs> orange pop, bath bomb and the last one is snowman dreaming, bath bomb. So that is all 10 in the Christmas 
bath time favourite set from Lush. And then again, sticking to the bath bomb themes, I got um, another four bath bombs and they're, they're there. The scents, I don't actually know if it tells me in the back. It says handmade sparkling fizzers that contains olive oil. That's random. Um, yeah, one's definitely lavender, unless they're all lavender. I'm not actually too sure. But yeah, they smell amazing. So I'm definitely stopped cutting bath bombs for a while, I reckon. Yeah, the next one was a bit of a kind of a joke present, but it is a remote control helicopter. I love it, I'd actually love it. And then the next thing I got was from the Kelpies, which is one of my absolute favourite places. Like this place makes me so happy. Um, if you don't know what they are, uh, I'll insert a photo of them. And it's basically a landmark in Scotland. But yeah, I got the Kelpies souvenir guide. Just tells you information all about them. Then I got the 100 piece jigsaw puzzle that I actually can't wait to do. Um, and then I also got the magnet with them on it and their names are actually Duke and that's Baron. Uh, yeah, so I got Kelpie stuff. So the next gift I got I'm actually wearing at the moment and I think it's called the Pandora Moments necklace. Um, I did actually know about this gift. My mum and dad kindly took me into Pandora to let me design it myself so I knew that it was, so they knew that it was perfect to how I wanted it and all that they didn't really want to choose it because it was more of a personalised thing like you build it yourself kind of thing like you pick your chain you pick the uh, the O or the heart and then obviously you pick the charm to go on it but it opens and you can take the charm off it or add more to it like the possibilities are endless so I got the Pandora moments necklace uh, staying on the theme of Pandora I also got a lovely new ring which I'm currently wearing again we'll insert a close-up photo of it and it's the Beauty and the Beast ring and it's just stunning. Um, and then I also got a charm for my bracelet, which I will insert a close-up photo of that as well. And yeah, I'm so grateful. I also got another ring and it's the Cinderella ring, but I got that present early. Um, but it's stunning, so I will insert a photo of that as well. That's everything from Pandora. So the next gift I got was a gift card. Um, it, it's basically like one of the restaurant favourite gift cards, so you can take it really to uh, any restaurant that's kind of on it. But I will be using it at Nando's because that's my favourite place. So I got a Nando's gift card essentially. Um, the next gift I got was um, three kilogra kilograms, is it kilograms, kg of Nutella. I will not be needing Nutella anytime soon <laughs> this is unbelievable uh yeah this is this is mad but yeah so i've got a big tub of nutella and it weighs a ton like comp comparing it to the size of my head yeah but that's the nutella <laughs> which is lovely the next gift i got was this now i haven't seen anything like this and it is a snow globe light up bottle gin liqueur. So please drink responsible again. Kind of got to say it as one of the disclaimer things. And it, it lights up and it's got the gin and it is orange and gingerbread. However, I don't believe that I'm going to drink it to be honest because I just love the bottle and I'll show you why I love the bottle in a second. But yeah. And in fact, I'll insert a video of it here so save it take it like out the box and stuff but it is stunning and it is a snow globe gin thing that lights up so cute cool. um yeah so that's that next thing i got was this mark jacobs perfect gift set which again is another one of my favorite perfumes the next thing i got was a curl set and it comes in this little uh, kind of rose goldy pink bag and also comes with a compact mirror but it's one of the like machines that does the curls yourself rather than a curling one. So I'm intrigued to try this out. Um, the next thing I got is trainers because it would not be a Christmas without trainers. 
I got brand new white Air Force, cannot go wrong with a pair of white Air Force, they're just, oh. I absolutely love this trainer, it's one of my favourite trainers, um, yeah, crisp white Air Force, and I also got another pair of trainers this year which I wasn't expecting, um, I don't expect any gifts obviously, but this is the box and it is a pair of Vapor Max and this is the colour wave which are stunning like this is me and a trainer basically but they are absolutely lovely and that's the sole of them which I love the kind of speckle detailing but yeah if you're thinking of getting a pair of these I would recommend going a half size down or even a size down I'm usually a six except in Air Force I'm a five and a half in Air Force and I'm also a five and a half in Vapor Max just because of how big these shoes are made um, so yeah that's my top tip but thankfully these did come um, in a size five and a half so it was, it was all good and they fit perfect now I'm sure you have been wondering what is in this bag with my initial on it so I'm going to go and get it and show you my main gift of 2021 was in this Santa sack with my initial on it which is absolutely stunning um, and it's also like really soft and I want to say velvet but I'm not too sure but yeah inside this was one of my main gifts which was the brand new MacBook Pro in space grey this was the 13 inch MacBook Pro with the Apple M1 chip which is just lovely and I did open it and set it up. I'm still in the middle of setting, setting up, signing into accounts and stuff. But this is it here. It is just absolutely lovely. I have ordered um, like a screen protector and like a case and stuff online. But yeah, I'm super happy to be part of the MacBook team now. And then my other main gift was a private registration plate for my car um it's absolutely stunning it's in 4d it's got a scotland flag on it like it's just unbelievable and obviously for like uh, security reasons i can't share that plate with you but that was also one of my main gifts for christmas so guys i think that is everything well guys that is another what i got for christmas haul wrapped up and done for another year i can't believe it's over the 2021 has just went so fast um, but yeah, I hope you all had a lovely Christmas and got what you wanted. But always remember, it's who's around the tree that's far more important, never what's under it. And with that being said, I'm very, very grateful for everything I have received. So thank you to every single person who got me something or even said Merry Christmas. It really does mean a lot. Um, yeah, so if you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash the thumbs up button. Comment down below, let me know what you got for Christmas or even what you did on Christmas Day. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, turn on the new bell notification so you don't miss any new videos. And I'll see you in the new year. Bye.